Hi friends, welcome to my channel and this is a VMware certification VCP6 data center virtualization training videos and this is the 10th video of this series and in this video I am going to show you how to create virtual machine clone on vSphere 6 or uh, ESX 6 so why we require the clone virtual machine like if you go to my vCenter server just want to show you we have one machine running here like we have just uh, uh, fresh installed this machine Win2K12 R2DC01 uh, like if I go to console like I am g uh, uh, I did the installation I done the some basic configuration like if you go here and see let me log into this server first like I did some setting uh, like rename computer setting this uh, time zone and uh, and some basic settings and now I'm going to install like some of the application which require me to uh, uh, have a, a configured machine so in case of any issue I can go to my clone machine and uh, and uh, and then use the clone machine if any issue is uh, like reported on the machine main my main machine which I'm like using for the my application installation on configuration so for now so I'm leaving the this virtual machine for now so in this video what we have in my demo environment we have one domain controller which is win2k12 dc01 if you want to check out here is my domain controller which we are using in last video so here is my domain controller I have um, like uh, my domain name is victorinfosol.com we have installed active directory DNS role on this server and my second server is vCenter server here you can see my vCenter server on which we have the login basically so here is the vSphere client and vSphere web client I have installed on my vS uh, vSphere server and we have three ASX host which is running ESX 01, 02 and 03 and all three is connected to my uh, vCenter server here you can verify my three ESX host and one virtual machine and we have, uh, we have storage coming from my ISC uh, uh, SAN which is a Starwind which uh, I have installed on my physical machine so let's do the cloning so we have multiple options before cloning the machine I recommend you to just shut down the uh, machine so we have the specific uh, clone at the time of our machine shutdown stage so just go here and you have multiple option go to guest and you can send the send guest shut down the guest OS Here you can see is initiated and it will take some time to shut down the server so now you can see the machine is set it down machine status and we have uh, option to clone this virtual machine from both like vSphere web client or vSphere uh, client so just want to show you the both option so here is the machine and if you right click from web client we have option to clone and we have option to clone to virtual machine clone to template and clone to library so if you go and use the legacy client which is vSphere client and go and click on clone button you can see we don't have any option which is we are getting here on web client like uh, clone to virtual machine clone to template or clone to uh, template in library so I'm going to uh, create a, a template uh, clone from web web client, and I also want to make it to like a uh, template. So clone to template. And just put the name like win two k eight. Uh, to clone and we have data center here click next and now we we have three ASX host on this uh, 
uh, so it will you can check the compatibility check on all the year success like compatibility check success so I'm going to put this machine on my ASX03 so click next so it's uh, select the virtual machine disk format same as if you want to change you can have the extra option uh, like uh, option to modify the settings and we have ISKC like virtual sand policies so going with the default one and I want to put this on my LAN 0 or LAN 1 so let's do it on LAN 1 you can see this compatibility check success click next and we have here is the option so provisioning time you can see uh, clone virtual machine to a template just click on finish now you can see this uh, task is started clone virtual machine once it's done you are able to see virtual machine here or template both here so you can see here is the our virtual machine and here is the it's uh, currently it's showing as a virtual machine but after uh, cloning this machine you're able to see it as a template because we are copying to template so just wait for some time to get the copy finished for virtual hard disk basically in the meanwhile let's uh, check out here option for deploying uh, like creating the clone from uh, we spare web uh, we spare client only so we have option here clone and if you click here and just type the name like pin to k8 r2 clone z one click next put it on esx3 also click next so we have like a source test format here you can see and either you can change so let's select the uh, LAN 1 click next and we have different option here like uh, do not customize customize using the custom wizard these option and power on the virtual machine after creation so so let's do one thing customize using uh, uh, the customization wizard if you click next you have the option here like uh, putting the name computer name license times and everything is here specified so if you go here customize the existing setting so if you have created any template like to to specify the customization you can do from here just go with the default one do not customize click next and we have option here like um, details related to uh, what we are going to achieve by this uh, cloning machine so if you click here edit virtual machine if you can't click on continue you are able to see here the machine uh, properties basically virtual machine properties if you want to modify anything you can go ahead and modify the settings here so after creating the virtual machine clone you are able to see the machine with the uh, like a, um, change setting like if you change the RAM, if you change the CPU, any any other setting, you are able to find it. So click OK. And now you can see we we have uh, run the two copy, uh, two cloning. One clone for like template from uh, web uh, web client, and one clone from uh, like uh, web uh, vSphere client for simple virtual machine cloning. So it it take time to copy the virtual machine uh, hard drive, hard disk file because it's it, it is copying the full uh, 40 gb disk uh, size so let's wait for some time and mm, it will take some time and uh, the task is completed successful so just waiting for some time so for now i'm pausing the recording here once the cl cloning has been completed i will be back so you can see the cloning which we have initiated from a web console is completed now and if you go you are not be able to see template here if we go on like inventory and vm send templates you are able to see the um, cloning which we have just uh, uh, done so 
just wait for a few more seconds and you are able to uh, see the uh, second clone which we have created from virtual machine to virtual machine from vspec client so now you can see the um, second is also completed which we have initiated the clone from vspec client so in this video we have learned how to uh, create a clone for virtual machine by using the uh, vSphere web client and vSphere or the legacy client also so thank you for watching and please subscribe me for more videos and if you have any query any question related to this please post me on my given mail ids thank you once again bye bye